working on top end speed. And on the first round, we're using these guys, shower loofers, which I tasked everyone to have by this session. Harry, show us your shower loofers. <laughs> oh, the four pack? Yeah. How are you attaching them to yourself? Maybe a Theraband. <laughs> that could go, that could go on my waist, actually. That could work. There's no way. If, if, if this works, we'll see. We'll see the evidence. He'll either have something attached to him or he won't. I could tie it up. You could, but that would be being nice to him. Seriously, though, every swimmer out there, get one of these guys. Fritz, you got one? Ilya's got one. It's just the perfect amount of resistance. They're dirt cheap. You can get these for like £1.50. I think the boys imported them from China. Time on some rope that you've probably got laying around, and it's just it connects the stroke just lovely. Speed stuff, drills, the works. I like how we're just doing things that aren't even like actual things. <laughs> Today we're going to work on one of the hardest things to get better at in the swimming pool and that's getting faster, working at top end speed. Now, very simply, to get faster at swimming you need to swim faster than ever before. So by doing 50s or 100s you're not going to be swimming faster than ever before, you're going to be swimming slower, you're going to be working aerobic system, maybe anaerobic power, stuff like that, but you're not going to be working that anaerobic capacity, that pure speed. So that's why we're going to go some 12 and a halves. 12 and a half are so short, think about it, halfway from a push, that's gonna take you about six seconds, right? It's five, six, seven seconds, depending on what stroke, how fast you are. And think about how little that takes out of you. So you then rest, and then you go again. And you're working at top speed, you're not breathing on free and fly, you're having a high stroke rate. And um, then you can do things like, for the first round, we're gonna add them loofers that I just talked about. And on the second round, we're gonna add fins, so we go even faster, we do an overspeed work. We we'll have some aerobic bolt within the middle because it's still early season, but for the most part, we're working on getting faster than ever today. Whenever we go fast, I think it's really important to start with some technical foundations, some sculling and some drilling, and then build the heart rate up before we go fast. So today, we're all going 675, where we go tw 25 sculling and 50 single arm drills. You probably know this is one of my favorite drills because it works on rotation through the pool, and as you extend out of the front, and it also just works on that cap really nicely. We're gonna do two 75s freestyle for everyone and then we're just gonna get onto the main stroke. If you do like the look of this session, feel free to give it a try. And if you want to do more sessions by me, you should check out my website, www.theswimsuitguy.co.uk, where I do full custom training plans that you can sign up for. Also, if you like the video, like it, and subscribe to the channel. Two, one. Run a fast 50 to finish off warm up. Two, one. Two, one. Two, one. We're on 10 50s, three a stroke count, three stroke count in time, three with some little spikes in, and then we're finishing off with a fast one. Harry up the top, 26 6 for Harry, nice. 27 6 for the boys, 27 2 from the Fritzinator, 31 0 and 31 5 for Josh. Cameron with the 30.6, 32 6 for Toby. All right, we're fast today then. Everyone's moving all right. 35.5. Did you go with Alex, Isis? 42.2, okay. Nice, 150 easy. And then sponge time.
just doing our swim down. Swim down is important. Eight 100s pull paddles at a pink five effort, just to reset, flush out any lactate we might have built, and then we're going again with the fins into some fly kicking, and that'll be the, the week done. Racing at the county champs this weekend, some of the kids. It's weird county champs over three weekends, we've got 100 IM. A four take us 24 hours into the future where Cam is fighting for the open title in the 100 IM. He's in lane four wearing the purple DDA cap and he's sitting in about third place as we hit the 25 mark. He's not a great backstroker, it's his weakest stroke, but he did tell me he was going to kill the underwater. He didn't. He went six meters. He told me he forgot. And he's now just ahead of fourth and fifth place. And as we hit the 50 mark, it's not looking great for Cam. But then we know he's a great breaststroker. His pullout's okay, he moves into second on it, but then he just goes absolutely crazy. My watch had this at a 15.2 split, so quicker than his backstroke, and he just blows Kalon away who had the 50 meter lead. He's still a bit high on his turn and I want him to get better at that, but he just goes absolutely in on the freestyle to come in and win him 56.5, beating his three year old PB at 56.8, which he'd done to come second to Jacob Whittle at the National Champs. Open title secured for Cam. Nice job. Short course, and then it goes to long course for the rest of the counties. 50 fly on Sunday, then it's uh, the next weekend, the weekend after the weekend after. Leave in the comments if you think this looks like swim down pace from Fritz. He says he's going easy. I mean, he's coming, what's that? 106. He says it's easy, I don't know. Set two, we've got the fins on. Come on! Yep! 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 Boom! Yep! That was good. Come on, all the way to the end. Yep! 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 like a little bit of kick to finish the session just eight 100 kick 50 fly 53 that's the kind of week done some of the guys are going to race tomorrow here 100 im i'll be with them guys only three racing 100 im the rest will be at mount kelly doing a long course session of 30 100s um, and john is going to be coaching that session so um yeah if you like the video do like it press the like button it takes a second and if you want to see more of these sort of videos Subscribe to the channel, there's more coming. Vlogs, suit reviews, the works. And um, if you like to look at the sessions and you train on your own and you need inspiration, well you can sign up to my custom training plans on my website, www.theswimsuitguy.co.uk and I'll write you a personal plan depending on how many sessions you do a week. If you want more info, just message me. Um, we can figure that out. All right, I'll see you on the next one.